shake but shake the problem is from since like it's going to be a whole year since i am i'm in a viswas or uh, or something because of the prophetic medicines there are numerous hadith regarding the prophetic medicines regarding many diseases but now as we are in the 21st century and we have so much uh, advanced medical uh, facilities and i myself uh, is a medical student so i am confused should we do this or that and if we don't have full faith in the prophetic medicine are we doing kufar we are a kafir and because of this i am yeah. so much depressed yeah. my brother my brother don't go to extreme it's very simple Allah the Almighty said, يَخْرُجُ مِنْ بُطُونِهَا شَرَابٌ مُخْتَلِفٌ أَلْوَانُهُ فِيهِ شِفَاءٌ لِلنَّاسِ This is concerning honey. So the Prophet وسلم, prescribed for somebody who had diarrhea, take honey. This is, you know, an advice. The Prophet وسلم, did not claim that he's a doctor, you know. So the Prophet وسلم, advised us when we eat one third for the food, one third for the water. and spare one third of your stomach. This is pure medical advice, but the Prophet didn't present it as a doctor. He presented it as a Prophet. You understand? So the Prophet وسلم, provided some medical advices because it's a matter of wahi. When he said that when a ta'un or plague afflicts a community, a plague or uh, you know something like COVID, he said, Do not, if you are in this town, do not leave it. Do not go out of it. And if you are out of the town which is afflicted with the plague, do not go to it. This is the first quarantine presented in history. The Prophet didn't say, I am Dr. Muhammad ibn Abdullah. So these advices, if you take them, fine. If you don't take them and you, as a medical student, you take the chemical drugs, okay, which have adverse effects and side effects and drug-drug interaction, it's entirely up to you. If you say, well, I didn't develop a taste for honey. I cannot take honey. You know, I don't drink camel milk. It's entirely up to you. There is no problem. You're not a kafir if you don't take it. Barakallahu feek. Thank you, brother.